this watch is so beautiful that I sold my previous suggest chronograph just for it I mean look at that this is beautiful it is awesome if it's like a French girl or something I will do something to this woman if I know what I mean French wee oui, wee oui, if you know what I mean yeah she wee oui, wee oui, that wee oui, wee oui. <laughs> This one is called uh, Chrono Heritage S423 by Suggest, but let's just call it Air Command because it is cooler that way and this is a clone or maybe an homage to uh, Blancpain Air Command. Spec wise, this is a 42mm diameter with thickness of 11.5mm. Uh, 13 millimeters if you count it with the sapphire glass uh, with luck with 22 millimeters and luck to luck 51 millimeters uh, dome sapphire crystal and manual winding caliber seagull st1901 the gold swan neck fashion with 21 jewel and yeah this is a very cool and great watch specification wise on paper, this watch should have been a big watch, but somehow my uh, seal dive is bigger than this watch somehow. Yeah, this watch is big, commanding, but it's beautiful and somehow simple. And in my previous Suggest watch, I always thought that Suggest brands on the dial is annoying, but in this one, it blends perfectly with this watch. This watch is somehow uh, beautiful and big, but in a subtle way and the movement itself is a proven seagull movement which is not evolving in any sort of way whatsoever since the 1960s but it's a beautiful thing to watch it's a beautiful movement and look at that uh, sweeping it's smooth it's silky this watch somehow became my favorite I mean if there's a complaint about this watch it's probably just the size it's kind of big for someone but it is a pilot watch it's supposed to be big it's uh, supposed to be feasible and this watch uh, checks all the marks and it's done perfectly uh, thank you to Blanc Pan for the inspiration but wow this watch is really something uh, this movement the style uh, even the dial, I mean, I love almost everything with it. Yeah, but then again, that S word in the crown is really annoying. They should have thought something more beautiful about that brand in the crown. But overall, uh, stylistically wise, this watch is perfect for me. The watch, the size, and that lovely movement. I mean, look at that. Even when I uh, put it upside down, I always love to see that movement. It's really beautiful. The swan neck fashion is really nice. And regarding the water system, probably just 50 meters on the catalog says, but hey, it's Chinese movement. Take it with a grain of salt. But then again, this is a watch that I already use in the water when it was rain, and it survived. It's really beautiful. I mean, there's nothing wrong about it. The see-through case in the back has really added the beautiful factor in this watch. Man, I really love this piece. So just really knock it off the ball with copying Blancpain design almost to the point of copying. And since it's kinda look like a diver watch, it also have a loom. Uh, although the loom is only applied on the dial and the bezel but not on the second sweeps but it's still a good uh, loom maybe not as good as diver but yeah talk about diver style this also have some bezel action listen kind of weird that the bezel action it's uh, more like a gmt watch rather than a dive watch but then again who cares this watch is beautiful <laughs> and all in all if you want this watch just bought it i guess because it is a proven movement and suggest it's not some sort of uh, scam company or something they quite a legit one they have many 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 uh, style though almost all of it is copy of something else but 
uh, uh, I already bought some of it but yeah I kind of sold it and maybe I will settle with this one because this is beautiful I just love how everything blends perfectly and again thanks to Blanc Pan for the style but yeah this watch is I don't know it's good it's not a grill maybe for someone even the Blanc Pan but for me this is perfect this is a keeper and maybe I will not sold it I really really gonna enjoy wearing this one and I hope you too can also enjoy it if you have the uh, opportunity but then again it's only me uh, take it with a grain of salt if you love it bought it if you hate it yeah I just hate it but if it's me I'm glad I bought it this is beautiful <laughs> I guess that is all I'm sorry if this review is not good for uh, your standard but then again I'm just trying to share what I love about this watch well thanks everyone bye